I feel like you said something profound. You was like, you either like super with it or you're not. There's no in between. Yeah. It's either you want to be a part of a sisterhood, a brotherhood. You want to have that type of relationship or you're just puffed up with the chest. Like, oh yeah, I wouldn't do that. But like I went into it for sisterhood. Like I went into it wanting to build female relationships. Mm -hmm. So I I don't get people that just don't want that. Like, Aww. why would I not want, you know, relationships with females in a positive light that we're doing positive things? Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
no Greek at all. Yeah, but it was, it's more like down south they like live, breathe, and and give it their all when it comes to that. Okay, like, I'm well, not yeah. saying it's not like that up there, but like you're not gonna have every organization, and then like the next closest school or chapters are gonna be like a little distance. You know what I mean? Out here it's like not nah, fact, but we from Maryland, so like that's up north. Yeah, but Some y'all got a lot though. Y'all got. A lot, it's a lot of schools and whatnot. Nah, right? facts. It yeah, is. Yeah. But y'all did. So y'all did. Y'all know about a little bit. It wasn't obviously clear until I got to college. But I started getting a little familiar. My principal was DSC, the one and only, and um, <laughs> that was she was a great influence on my life. And when I got to school, you know, it definitely changed. It opened up my eyes for a little more. Okay. What about yeah. you? Um, so for me, my middle school counselor was an AK. Okay. So I did see that little glimpse of it, like in middle school. And then when I was in high school, my senior year, I just knew I was going to be AK. Like I was going on YouTube, trying to look at different like pledges and like, like just trying to get as much information as possible. I didn't even know what I was getting myself into, but I'm like, yes, I'm going to be one of them because yeah, uh huh. I, it wasn't even a, like, it wasn't a thought. It wasn't like I had to fall into it. No, no, no. I am this, it is that. And yeah, we're going to go with it. That's crazy. Well, I guess I got to set the, the tone for the people that don't know, of course, um, DST. A.K.A. A5A. You're supposed to say mine last, but go ahead. I'm supposed to say yours last? Yeah, you say the best for last. Yes, <laughs> sir. I did say yours for last. Oh, I'm a, oh for the people that don't know, I'm a Q. There's a lot of people who don't know I'm a Q. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. yeah, I wouldn't have guessed that. Yeah, you don't give Q vibes. No. What I give, like, yo? Yeah. No, 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 yo. no, no, no. He actually, yo. he actually gives, like, he might have been the person that was like, I ain't doing that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's you, probably You give point. that. That's more than anything. That's but I don't know, because you is. was out for real. I was so out. That, that's when I met you. So. You was a party guy in college? No, he was out. That's Man, like, was literally. It, I was out. So when, it's like seeing you calm and like in this element is to me, like surprising. I'm big literally. yo now, though. <laughs> yo, to my yo's. <laughs> you feel me? Like, running through the street with your yo's. Like, yeah. Running through the, <laughs> with my <laughs> yo's. You feel me? They probably did that for us. You know how that go. Yeah. <laughs> this. Right here, <laughs> <laughs> yo. But no, nah, no, nah, I definitely was out. But like, it's crazy. It's crazy the transition, though. I, but, mm. but I feel like that's everybody. No, yeah. no, no, it's not everybody. It's not everybody. You see, old heads still repping from head to toe. I feel like it's a gap. I feel like you super out, you chill, and then once you get old, you get out again. No, no. no. Some of them old ones, they can't let it go. Yeah. They like, you can. know how all of us right here got our own paths and lanes? Like, when we crossed, we were people that just crossed, but we still had our own identity. I think like, some people don't have their own identity, and they join, and that's who they become. Mm. Right. I was about to say that. Yeah. When that's all they know, and that's their life, and, and they got cool like, well, when I'm they a, join, yeah. oh, they don't want to get that up. Yeah. Mm. You're going to be right back corny, though, once you leave college. Like, You're going to be popping in school. But. I feel like you said something profound. You was like, you either, like, super with it, or you're not. There's no in-between. Yeah, it's either you want to be a part of a sisterhood, a brotherhood, you want to have that type of relationship, or you're just puffed up with the chest like, oh yeah, I wouldn't do that. But like, I went into it for sisterhood. Like, I went into it wanting to build female relationships. Mm -hmm. So I I don't get people that just don't want that. Like, Mm -hmm. why would I not want, you know, relationships with females in a positive light that we're doing positive things. Oh, <laughs> it's gay. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm gonna be straight up. I, no, yeah. no, it's so not, what did you go into it for? No. Because clearly you had, you got going into it, you're getting brothers. So what was it? What was it? Why? Why so did you do it? So it's two things, two things, to be honest. One, I'm gonna be straight up with you. I felt like all the that they were talking about, my mom used to teach me. Like, you're a man first. This is how this is what I learned from it, like coming into college, right? I wasn't introduced to like the parties and the girls. I seen um Steve Harvey won the humanitarian man award. I feel like this sounds so cat, but this is real. Like anybody that know me, like I was class president, student president, uh uh SGA president, NASA president, one of two people that went to Chicago from my high school. I got a one of two people in Baltimore that got a full scholarship to a PWI. We'll talk about that. And then in the college, I was Mr. Like, so I was already that person. So when I seen Steve Harvey. I think he threw up the hooks at the end of his uh, humanitarian mm. humanitarian man award, and I'm like, oh, I want to do that. And then when I came to college, when I did go to an HBCU, 
they just, I was like, yo, because I was curious. I'm like, yo, can I do this? Can I do that? They be like, you can do whatever you want. You're a man first. You just got to take what come with it, the responsibility that come with it. My mom used to always said that. So from that day, I was like, I feel like I'm already this shit. I just got to prove it to y'all. Swear to God, I told my, um, my profile asked me that. He was like, what you, what you want to do this for? I feel like, honestly, I'm already a Q. Y'all just don't know that yet. He was like, that's wow, That's crazy. You're not. That's crazy. No, I mean, but that's a good answer, though. Yeah. I didn't know that. I mean. Yeah, yeah, but that's a good answer. Though. But yeah, so the answer. But I say, I feel like sometimes, just looking back on it, I feel like if, if somebody wasn't in it and it was like, it's weird, I wouldn't be mad. I would be like, I understand. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 100%. <laughs> I'm just saying. Yeah. Like, it's some. <laughs> I, saying, I don't I don't care, bro. I, I, but at the time when we were in college, in the atmosphere that we were in, it was the cool thing to do. Mm-hmm. You know, it was that was the thing that was the end of the end, even the parties, the juices, like come on, like in college the That's atmosphere. HBCU, yeah, HBCU. The HBCU mm-hmm. atmosphere. Yeah. Uh, no, cuz you like I said, like going in your eyes did lit up like I mean, actually, I started at Virginia State before I went to Bowie, and I think that would really, like, open, like, just seeing just all the Greeks just on the yard, like, that was just, like, I don't know. It just make you excited and make you, like, dang, I want to be that. Like, see, I ain't see none of that. I went to McDaniel College, a PWI, mm. so I ain't see it. I literally transferred to BAQ. Mm. Like, it was a business move for me. It was like, bro, that's what I want to do. I'm going to do it. So, like, but when I, I'm not going to lie. I'm not about to sit here front. When I went, when I got to school, I'm not gonna lie. Morgan State was probably the best school I ever went to. Dang! Damn, I, can't say I that. wish I was going to Morgan or Bowie or something. I'm all the way by the shore. Crazy. I'm by the shore though. You know, yeah, we deep the down the street. <laughs> we can't. I gotta get two hours and thirty minutes to get back to y'all. Like yeah. I'm, they got me in a cut. You ever been to UMS? I'm, I'm in the cut by the cold, by the water. The beach is beaching. Like, hey, let me tell you this. They didn't have no basketball. What is it? Football team? No we football ain't team. had no football team. We had a basketball, basketball team. And then y'all not going to go on. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> we had crab legs and a cat. <laughs> Listen, oh, I'm saying, you want me yes? If you're watching this and, and, and you, was, you was out when I was out, you know, it was a select few schools that was like that. You want me yes? Dell State? Let's just say, that was one of them schools. So yeah, yeah. I don't know how you complain about that. That was fun. That was, it was like that. I guess it depends, you know, from your perspective. From your perspective, I felt like we had a lack of like uh, Greek life. Mm. You know, it could have been better, but I mean, people get suspended. Cool. Then we also didn't have the football team. So that means with not having a football team, you know, the football team would be like 30 to 50 guys. Mm. Just having a basketball team is 10. <laughs> Now there's right. 10 guys on right. the campus for the girls. <laughs> we gonna need a football team out here. So imagine how the basketball players felt. They got, they feel. They probably uh, loved it. They loved yeah. it. What? Yeah, they probably did. Yo, what? Yo, what? We had a competition. No. Nah, but nah. that's, I mean, crazy as that sound, Bowie, they had both and it still be the same when females ran through. Like, Damn. it could still be the same thing. It could, yeah. And I didn't like Bowie for me. It was, I like Bowie, but I didn't like that it was a, more like a commuter school. So a lot of people like went home on the weekends and stuff. So it just really depends on your perspective. At Virginia, been at Virginia State, been away in a cut. It was like, where, where y'all going? Like we gotta all be on campus. So that made it more like live. Yeah. But Bowie, def- I mean, they both had its pros and cons, definitely. So but how I y'all do- feel about it now? Like how y'all f- just <laughs> like when you say like I'm a Delta, when you say I'm an AKA, I'm an Alpha. Like like how do y'all feel about it? Like do, do y'all still have a sense of pride in it? I mean, I know I feel like you do for sure. How, because I wear pink? No, I just you give me the and it's, it's a good thing. It ain't a bad thing. I feel like you you had that pride thing. Okay. What I about you, bro? You you got that? Yeah, I'm I'm very <laughs> you know prideful to be a member of Alpha Phi Alpha. You feel me? Like, but it, like you said, just when with times go on, it's like all right. You know what I mean? Like it ain't the same. Like I can come out here and find a chapter to join and whatnot, but like. I ain't pledged with y'all or cross with y'all. And I know we a brotherhood and all that, but it's still like it's human at the end of the day. You know what I mean? So just because you mm. an alpha, <laughs> a brother, don't mean you necessarily a brother that I want to be around. Mm. You feel me? So. Right. That's a fact. What about you? You still got that? I'm with him. Honestly, the older you get, even that's crazy because even with some of your last sisters, I don't know, like they say it's a long-term sister, but really. Is it? 
Is it like you grow apart? You people start being moms, living their lives, but you know, it's just not the same to me. Like when I see other sorrows, depending on my mood, like I'm not always gonna be like, oh, let me go agree her. Like, right. hey, sister, no. Yeah. Sometimes I'll go the other way. Okay, I feel like me right now. So, Jayla, are you like on that side or are you like the opposite side? She said she just went out for Founders Day. She's Facts. still. Wait, no, she no, 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 hold she on. She's throwing a pinky up. <laughs> no, 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 no. Ski. No, no, hold on. I know, hold on. No, I ain't, I'm not throwing a pinky up. I'm not skewing. I was. A, so for me, like my experience, like I crossed on a line of 56 girls. Mm. <laughs> Sorry, it was a shot. It was a shot. <laughs> no, take one. Honestly, that shouldn't be a shot, though. It shouldn't be, but it, it was the first line back. So mm-hmm. like the AKs in my school got suspended for some years, and then I was a part of the first line back. Mm-hmm. So I have a very unique experience because I also crossed as the first freshman. I was the only freshman on a line of 56 girls. Oh, you were so a freshman? I was a freshman. I'm about to say, they let the freshman cross this? And I claim yeah. the spot. You had to be yeah. like a, uh, a sophomore. Uh, yeah, sophomore. You had to have a, uh, a, 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 a certain amount of credits. Yeah, that or, yeah I had uh, that. What's the oh, call? So you was just... I met the criteria. They're not going to decline me. So you was an AKA for four years in college? Yes. Oh, you had to be a legacy. That's what it was. Like your parent had to be a part of that. No, she just met the criteria. She probably had like some high school. But go ahead. I'm sorry. We sorry. We sorry. So I met the criteria. I was the only freshman. But because the line just had came back, we have seniors on the line. Half the line gone by the next year. But I feel like our hardest thing with 56 girls is coming together as one. Like we had a lot of internal things that we had to get through as just women and cooperating with each other that I feel like the sisterhood that I went in for, I didn't actually get. Mm-hmm. I didn't get the lovingness. I didn't mm-hmm. get, I'm like, they fussing child. I'm like learning and observing. Like, Especially this how so young. Women are catty I'm so young. Anyway. They are. I was like, like, I thought it was a sisterhood. sisterhood. What are we doing? We are uh, fussing bro, right I, now. I, I can feel you. So like, my first probably, I got kicked out of school the second semester. Like, I we, we we crossed in October. By February of the spring semester, I was out of school. I got kicked out. Why? What you was doing? I was fighting, but I'm just saying. <laughs> All I'm saying is like, and then they tried to kick me out the frat because it was a big fight. So this is my first introduction to like fraternity. So I'm understanding that this is a this is that INC Incorporated. Mm. Oh. It's incorporated mm. for sure. It, that means it's a business. It ain't, these ain't, yeah, these could be my brothers, but at the end of the day, if something goes wrong with this business, you out of here. Mm. So like, that was my, that was a fresh introduction for me. So I kind of got turned off super quick. Mm. Cause I'm like, bro, I just did all this for my family. And even I thought I was fighting for my family and y'all ready to kick me out. I thought this was a brotherhood. So it kind of, from there, it kind of like turned me away. Yeah. That's, but I mean, I don't know. That's just crazy. So like, you said you was the first freshman, or the only the freshman? only freshman, only freshman, only freshman. Only freshman. Gotcha, yeah, because gotcha, gotcha. normally you got to yes. yeah. yeah, which is unfortunate because that means my senior year I was the only one from my line leaving. You know, mm-hmm. I'm the last girl standing from my line. Mm-hmm. So, um, I also in college I did a dual degree, so I went to New York for a year. So, of course, by going to New York for a year, I'm distant from Mm. the next line coming in. Mm -hmm. I didn't get to pledge them. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, so my senior year coming back on campus, I'm this YouTuber. I didn't give what I... Yeah, just... She already had a nice platform. I'm sorry. No, you did. She already had a nice platform (laughs) using... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, I can relate as far as being the first line back because my chapter was suspended for Mm. about two years. Then we came back, and it was 36 of us. And to me, that's still a lot. Like mm-hmm. It's a lot to manage. It's, it's a lot click, of girls. start to be clickish yeah. at that point. Mm-hmm. So, like, I'm cool with, like, a few of my last stitches, but all 36, I, it's not good. It's hard. It's, it's hard. hard to keep up with that many mm-hmm. girls. It yeah. was 13, and it was a lot for us. Gosh. That was the biggest. <laughs> that, was, that was, like, yeah, but I said that was the biggest line. That was the second biggest line in our chapter for real. Yeah. So 13? Like, Dang. Yeah, that was our biggest line in our chapter. 13 well. was huge. Dang. Huge? Like, what? They clowned us. Yeah. Like, what? Clowned y'all. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah that's a lot. Friends. That is a lot, though. That is. 13? 13? Hell yeah. Well, 13 is a lot. Especially? We started with seven. We finished with five. So. Mm. 
I just like I think about my experience. I'm like, what would that experience be like if it was only 15 girls on the line? Where we actually would have probably gotten to it. Been 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 I don't see how y'all can get to know 55 other motherfuckers. But I you can't, can't though. Can you? you can't. Like, did you know everybody's name? <laughs> oh, that was a bad question. I think that's a, I I'm mean, supposed that's... to so I'm to remember all the Greek oh. alphabet. All everything else and everybody name. I mean, oh, that's that's all. Like, now hold up, my brain and the school work at the same time too. Now hold up, how is the brain working like that? I, I was just asking. I don't know. I, I thought mean, she was looking at you like you don't think I, I thought know she. My know, I, I thought she was about to say Maybe. you don't think I know my. Yeah, fifty six. So, so no, hold up, that's so a lot. Wait, so did you know? Th- you said thirty six. I knew all. Yeah, we knew each other's name. We knew birthdays, name. Can I tell you today? No. But we know that <laughs> oh, yeah, then. No, we had to learn all that then. Like we knew everybody's name, birthday. Hobbies, like, and that was a lot. Let that me, was a lot. Let me ask y'all this, y'all too. Why do girls hate the word cat? What? <laughs> like, why do y'all hate that word? What's the word? Because you're playing with us. Cat? Yeah. yeah. Cat? What is I feel cat? like, like, you playing with us. Like, what is that? What, like, you're you not saying I'm legit. Like, cat? Editor. Like, nah, like, like, what would it be? I don't know like no other word for paper, it. Like you paper, like you ain't legit, You ain't made, like right, I you guess. Ain't ma- Why yeah. do we say, yeah, we say Specifically paper. girls I know, we do that. go like, you no, saw we had I a lot care. of oh. I didn't even know what you were talking about. Okay. Well, my line specifically had a lot of issues with people trying to try us, you know, again, because we were with bigger line. And we got to, you know, it was, it was hurtful because it's like, you, you coming out, you think, you, you think, oh no, nobody can't tell me nothing. Well, y'all to say I'm cat. Y'all that's cat. True. You go through the process and do it. But not even so. That's understandable. Like fresh off is understandable. Yeah. But I feel like girls, even ten years in, if you say cat, they hate it. They be like, Don't. like. I mean, we're females. We since like we mm. it's like certain things. Don't play with us. Like, cause me, I come in the room like you can scratch my back. <laughs> so I feel like, but all my homies, we gonna say we be on the same thing. I think we got thing. something to prove more than y'all. You know, it's it's like men versus females. Mm. Y'all already kind of downplay our situation. And I think it's by process. region too, though. Like region, like if you come down south, you call it cat. They probably want to fight. Oh, for sure. Like, bro, you gotta relax. It's too much testosterone <laughs> in this. Like, yeah. relax. Like, chill. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. None of the sororities at my school was was cat. You know what I mean? So everybody was. You look like the type of <laughs> say you cat, you be mad. No, nah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't care. He not giving, he giving. I'm no, giving, yeah, yeah, I'm giving, I, yeah, I don't care. Yo, this episode is sponsored by The Morning Meetup. Man, shout out to my guy, David Shines, man. He's probably one of the few people I know who actually built multiple multi-million dollar businesses, right? He created The Morning Meetup to help other entrepreneurs do the same thing. Now, listen, as an entrepreneur myself, I know how hard it can get, especially when we start making money and we get to like this financial cap that we can't get past. And honestly, let's be real. They say it ain't what you know, it's who you know. We probably can't get past this cap because we either, one, outgrew the people around us, or two, we just being lazy and winging in the rooms we need to be in. It's just plain and simple. But trust me, this is your time because the morning meetup is that room we got to be in. It's filled with, filled with entrepreneurs getting to it. They reading different books every month, right? They holding each other accountable. And it's just honestly just something dope to be a part of. So listen, if you're an entrepreneur and you're trying to get to this bag, you're trying to flourish more than you've been flourishing now... You got to go to the morningmeetup.com. That's www.themorningmeetup.com and join now. Let's get to it. I'll see you there. Yo, how is it being like like a, like a famous alpha, like a famous Greek guy? Uh, it, it was, you know, it, it had its run. It was, it was fun. It was, it was a good time. Yeah. But what I, was about like, now, I was like the though? LeBron of Greek life. LeBron? I, I hated LeBron you LeBron. when I was coming up. That's cool. They hate LeBron too. He was a. I hated why, you. What was he why. doing? He was the host, but he like for me. I'm. I'm just fuck it. Like I don't care. Mm. I was. I was hating on him. Mm. Who was the other couple people? Yeah, it was me. It was Duck. Yup, I hated him. Duck the Kappa. Um, who else? Who else really? I mean, you got Jay Dukes. He nah, I mean, he wasn't cute. like lit like y'all. Oh, then Jay oh, Dukes was Greek like shit? yeah. No Greek shit. It was really me, you, Duck. Duck. I like Jay Dukes because. I felt like he was one of the few people that could really do what I could do, like host. Yeah, he's a great host. But I felt like niggas like you, like niggas would just ho- get y'all because y'all was lit. And I'm like, they don't even host, man. Like, they just lit. Like, I used to be hating. Nah, I used to I mean, be hating. Yeah. But, okay, I will give you that, though. That was a role that I had to learn. I did have to learn how to host because hosting and telling jokes are two different, two different things. You feel me? Way two different things. So I did, I did step into that lane not knowing, but 
I figured it out, though. I used to be hating. Like, but this guy stupid. was lit. Like, they used to book him for all the shows. And I remember one that's working. Like, yo, I can be on the mic. This nigga just pull up. Like, yo. Like, oh, my God. <laughs> Jay, Jay Deuce used to do the same thing. It's a funny story. We cool now, so I can say. But he used to he used to call the schools of places I was booked. Who y'all got? Oh, we got Bankshot. He going to host Homecoming. What y'all paying him? I'll be paying him three. I'll come do it for two. Sheesh. That's what he used to do. Damn. We had a show together at Prairie View. And he, like, we was co-hosting it. He pretty much told them, like, I don't need no co-host. I can do it by myself. I'm like, nigga, you taking money away from me. You taking money away from me. Like, I, did, no, I wouldn't have did that, but. Yeah, you can't, you can't do that. I mean, for content purposes, I would have did that, too. Mm-hmm. Stop messing yeah, with you. Nah, nah. <laughs> but, no, that's my dog, though. He cool. He definitely doing his thing and shit, though. You know <laughs> Yo, did y'all feel like y'all ever, anybody, did y'all ever feel like y'all was, like, the black sheep of this shit? Like, of your line, of your chat? Like, definitely me, for sure. You did? I felt like that. That ain't make you hate your. Me and my sister. So I have a twin, for those who don't know. And, like. I don't know if that would did it. Like, if I'm so used to being a twin, it's like, shoot, we got our own sisterhood going on since birth. Y'all coming in here just learning how to be real sisters. So, I don't know. I think some scenarios, I felt like a little, it used, used to give a little hate. It gave a little black sheep. Um, we're very goofy. <laughs> I be mean, doing my jokes, too. So, I don't know. Like, again, you coming around with females who... Sadity and like just I don't know I did feel like that a little bit mm. like I said I go with the clicks and everything like I feel like Jayla you was a freshman did you feel like you ever felt like you was a black sheep ever um, <laughs> she was lit I was nah, lit. she was lit yeah. that's what I'm saying like, you're not gonna, nah. if you but came that, with a big person like 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 yours like they would draw to that you like a freshman I think. cross like what can anybody say to yeah. you but I mean that could be like you, ain't, you think you all that like you ain't you feel me like uh, that could make no. I think that I was so young that they were older. So, like, their interest. Like, I didn't start drinking until I turned 21. So, my first two years of college, I wasn't drinking. I wasn't partying. So, I could have been that girl. It didn't pan out to be that girl. Like, Mm. the experience that you said at UMES where you're like, oh, it's so fun. It was. Like, I was really in my books trying to, like, get out of there. Take me out the woods. Get me away. But I did desire sisterhood. You know, what? Did you ever, ever have a black sheep experience? No, I was lit. I feel like I mean I was lit, but I feel like I was a black sheep. Maybe still to this day, I feel like I'm a black sheep. Yeah. I mean, I, I wouldn't say I was a black sheep. Like I, I literally went to the military and did like boot camp and stuff before I even went to college to go play it. So all that oh, so working was, out and it was like, yo, what's, all right, see, what's up? Like I got kicked out, and I think I think did our chapter get suspended after that? But I got kicked out and niggas started blaming me for shit. Like, <laughs> like niggas just started yeah, like, yeah. it's Jay fault. Yeah, like, yeah. so what? Like, nigga, they had a whole intervention with me at my, like, what? Like, nigga, even that, when I went to cop and became Mr. Cop and I had bras running against me and shit, like, I always felt like the black sheep. So, like, that made me, to be honest, that I think that made me, that shot me away from the fraternity even more. Mm-hmm. Like, all of it, like, all of that shit matters. It's like, people just look at you from afar and be like, Damn, like he used to be out over like bro, like See, that's y'all crazy. wasn't fucking. Y'all with both me. got similar situation because you said you saw Steve Harvey do it. Oh, I want to be a part of it, la da 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 da. And then once you you finished, it wasn't what you expected. It Same wasn't you, what you I expected. Was researching in high school, you get there for the sisterhood. That ain't what you thought it was gonna be. You know what I mean? That's kind of that's yeah, kind of shitty. Nah, what do y'all think the disconnect is? Because I was talking to um some older bros or whatever. Not to turn this into a coma, yeah, but I'm just curious. And the older bros always be like. Y'all ain't reaching back to us. When we was young, we used to reach back to our old heads and you know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, I wonder what happened to that. Like, what, what, where was the disconnect? Uh, that's, that's a lot. Like, for us to be doing what we're doing and then still try to find a way to mm-hmm. reach back. And then I'm not even in Ohio. So, like, me right. trying to reach out to mm-hmm. bros in Ohio and like, hey, what's up? If y'all need anything or like, it's just, I, I think that's what it is for, for me personally. I just got my own shit going on. And it's not on some selfish shit. It's like I still got goals that I need to, uh, you know, hit. And, uh, yeah, I'll take that one. So. Pour your own, man. What? Yeah, no. Ladies got to pour their own drinks. What? what? Yeah. Here, nah, fam. ladies here, pour here, fam, I got you. <laughs> I bet you would, first fam. Go ahead. Like, dang. Now, just pour it in the Now, cup. ladies pour just their pour own poison. The you got to get yourself drunk because I don't want you to be like, Jay got me. You got yourself drunk. Look at this guy. <laughs> You probably wish that one. 
No, nah, never. That was not me. I used to throw parties in, in school. I bet you did. But, like, I used to really be, like, on it. Like, not, I'm not trying to, like, have sex with women. Like, I'm like, I'm like, no. You're a liar, nigga. You try to have sex. I had, a, I had a girlfriend shit. the whole time when I was in college, first of oh, all. Oh, brother. Not saying I didn't cheat on her, but what I'm saying is that I was still <laughs> focused. It was like, I wasn't trying to get another relationship. I already had a relationship. <laughs> I was just... But yeah, we used to go like we used to canvas uh, the school and go look for like other venues that we could like throw parties at. Cause and you could cheat on your girl. It was no, far no, had no, to be no, farther no. enough so she ain't no. No, I mean big big shout out to her. her name is Bree. She live in LA. Big shout out to her. If if she wasn't who she was, I would I wouldn't be who I was today without her. That's and real. you dogged her out. Come, dog was young. Was, yeah. You dog ass nigga. I was, I was definitely young, but young, like she knew, dog. you know what I mean? Like she had she her little, over. she did her little thing. Oh, she cheated on you too. I mean, kind of, you know. But yeah, if it wasn't for her, because she went to that school first. So when I got out of boot camp, I went to that school, became an alpha, and then everything mm-hmm. worked out. So okay, so and we still cool. She are are guys faithful in college? Some, I, yeah. not the ones I know. Are girls faithful in college? Yes. Not the, you said not the ones you know. <laughs> no, uh, 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 are girls faithful in college? I was faithful in college. Oh, girl, you had a boyfriend in college? Yes. Follow. The whole, the whole time I was in college. Oh, my God. Y'all got God. together after you was AK? Before. You a liar. I met him my first semester. I pledged AK my second semester. Y'all so you mean to tell me, and, and he was your boyfriend throughout college, entire college? And you never cheated on him? No, I did not cheat on him. So you ain't have you ain't have fun in college? No, I didn't until my senior year. So that's when it turned up. My senior year? Yeah. So y'all broke up senior year? We, well, he went to play ball overseas, so he wasn't at the college. So you just oh, went from. So that's why he wasn't cheating because you wanted to get that. that. Uh, what? Hey, what? She, 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 she thought he was going to the camera. NBA, yeah. and she was trying to get that ball paper. She's like, I can't cheat. No, uh, I need a new camera. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm trying to vlog. Like, I uh, Artie was vlogging. Well, you need a better camera. You know what I mean? Every, <laughs> come on, man. You know, every two years, iPhone update. Come on, you gotta get a new camera. Yo, um, we got me. And he went overseas. Too. She's like, uh, uh-uh, uh, uh, uh. So wait, did you cheat in college? Um, you talk your shit, Queen. She probably still talk to that guy right no. now. <laughs> so I had a relationship coming in college as well. He's a bro, actually, but we did. We went to two different schools. He went to A and C. Mm. I was at. Oh, yeah. So get straight to the answer. Did you cheat or not? <laughs> I no 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 no. I ended it. I ended it around the time I it was a lot. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's like, I want to. I feel like I want to cheat. There was other ahead. stuff going on, and I enjoy. I wanted. I really did want to enjoy my college experience before I graduated. So and you basically and I did wanted to like. I did. I did. I, I said I do not want to have any regrets. Really? I, I was. I want to. What was that movie? Um, when she was married to the same the Tyler Perry movie. She was married to the same guy since eighteen. Mm-hmm. What that Tyler Perry movie? I don't know. No. Temptation. <laughs> temptation. I don't know if y'all seen Temptation. Wait. The, the, wait. The, 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 the dude that gave the girl AIDS. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Honestly, I, that movie changed my life. I'm not gonna lie. I, wow. We sound like for the bad. No, no, no. We sound like for the worst. Like shit. No. Outside of the AIDS part, obviously. But I mean, outside I knew of that. She was. It's just like something you yearning for because this all I knew. Like that was my first everything. So mm-hmm. I'm like, look. Before I graduate college, I need. So you was, you was yearning for that. I was. That college. I was, and I and I did my. And she thing. got it. She yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> You ain't shit. I ain't even gonna lie. I, 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 I had fun. So you ain't really stepped off the porch until senior year. Yeah. So senior year just went crazy. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> hey, why? <what? laughs> hey, yo, he is a crazy right? dude. Right? Like, come on. I'm still at UMES. I'm still in the middle of nowhere. It's still two guys to pick from. Boy, I mean, people. A lot of people travel to UMES. You know what I mean? And if you're in a climate with a whole bunch of ugly people, eventually somebody, somebody gonna start looking good. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That's facts. I'm but, but listen, so That's my facts. senior my senior year, I That's also facts. like started a hair company. So I was very much still into making my money. What am I gonna do after this? Like I had already experienced New York. I had big dreams. I was a big dreamer. Mm. So all the guys could never handle me. I'm making my own money. I didn't told them to take in the dorm, you know, like you have the apartment style dorm and it come with the bed, the bed. Mm-hmm. Can y'all take that out? Cause I got rooms to go delivering my set here. Oh, that's what you, I did that my mm. senior year. Okay. Yeah, yeah like yeah, yeah. I'm on some like. Yeah. So when did you start having fun? Damn. You grew up with both your parents? Yeah, I have both my parents in my life. That's that makes why. sense. That's yeah. Why, yeah, yeah. So basically, because I mean, she had both my parents. So because she, because, <laughs> no, no, so basically, everybody got a single parent is a hoe. Basically. No, I'm not talking about the hoe part. I'm no, talking about the big dream and like, you oh, know. Like, I had big dreams, nigga. 
Yeah, well, my, I mean, my, my parents the way she My parents was military, and yeah, like my and dad fought in Iraq. My home. mom got my her kids in real structured home over there. Yeah, yes, yeah. like oh yeah. my yeah. god, yeah. Yeah. like yeah. you gotta, you gotta go to college. You gotta be on time. You gotta be on time. You gotta be on time. Yeah, don't make me toxic. Yeah, come on, man. Yeah, you product. It don't make sense if you come from a two parent household. They tell you to go to bed. You gonna have better dreams because your sleep schedule gonna be better. <laughs> no, seriously, they tell you what to major in the college. You know they I mean? tell you like, how to build yourself, how to do on, this. Do that. That. Y'all really gonna let this man sit up here and do that? No, it's facts. No, I mean, I'm yeah, with but him. I can say like so I. So they feel, tell you to go to bed early so you got better no, but dreams. Listen, I, but I did fear. Come on, y'all. Y'all really structure. gonna let this man? It's but listen, structure. I did fear my parents. I fear not yeah. making them proud, it's not so doing the right thing. So I always was trying to. Be the cookie cutter girl, like mm-hmm. okay, I, I got to college, I got the boyfriend, I'm gonna be with him. Okay, I'm gonna focus on my grades. Okay, I'm not gonna drink until I'm 21. You got siblings? Huh? You got siblings? No, I have yeah. 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 like, yeah. 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 That shit sound boring as hell. Yeah, no hey. siblings. Oh, oh, but, 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 but on YouTube, days. on YouTube, don't say that because they be say that's the most litest years of my life. We can, it's on YouTube. It's documented. Freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior year, babes. I made the most star, money, though. babes. No, you got I made the money, yeah, for sure. Babes, we documented the whole thing. So while it seemed like it was boring, I'm the one holding the camera in college when it's when it's I, cool, it's cool now. <laughs> it's cool when y'all do it. It's a problem when I no, do it. No, you was back ahead of your day, time though. That was back lit. in the day. What I will say, in hindsight, all the jokes aside. All the jokes aside, right? <laughs> Let's be real. No, 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 no cap. And it worked out for you because mm-hmm. shit, if I was a little bit more focused. I probably be a little further. You feel me? Like yeah. this shit lit. Like and your shit is like you probably don't even. Your shit is consistent. Like the work panned out when they show for itself. You get what I'm saying? So like as much as I could joke, like I'm just be, be bullshitting for real. But like it definitely worked out. That's me, I had a little bit more fun in college, right? And I'm working a little bit more harder right. now because it's like my dumb ass, like. But you right. know what I'm saying? Like, it's, yeah. but we it's, can tell our kids how to do better. How to do better? Yeah. We, can, yeah. we, can, be, we can be that structure home. No, no, no. Because no, I would tell my kids to loosen up a little bit. Like, okay. I mean, I was a little bit, but that's now, why would my you do parents. that? Well, all right, you see, if your parents. Facts. No, I just because I didn't. So okay, so just I moved, so she don't I moved to Atlanta three years ago. Me coming to Atlanta, I'm like, y'all party. Like, oh, yeah. I'm like, this is different. Like, yeah. I mean, I get HBCU life, but like yeah, the, the after hours and then the, the hookah lounges. And then I'm like, I was, I'm like, I wasn't, I was said, I dang, I'm not prepared. I'm 28 and I'm just now like, what well, was I? I wasn't prepped right for the outside. Bro, you life. know what's crazy? Because I came to Atlanta like, this is too much. Too much. <laughs> no. after, they said after hours, six o'clock. <laughs> Oh no, <laughs> she probably like, oh my God, never seen this. Lit. I'm but going off a founder's is, day. Isn't it crazy, like, the change the dynamic of, like, like, you see how, like, she's like, I'm going to tell my, fr- my my kids to loosen up a little bit. Uh-uh. Nigga, are you, cr- like, she's, like, super successful. Yeah. On you. And I'm like, bro, nigga, I wish I was more focused. Yeah. You feel me? Like, which, I, I don't know. How many subscribers you got on YouTube? So what? I have two channels. I have one with 300,000 and one with 250,000. <laughs> 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 I, I was working in college. I was working. And you want to tell your, tell your kids that to, to loosen up, girl? You was out here. No, that's, bro, that's that's smart. I, but I mean, it's it's a, I did I did miss out on some things. Girl, like what? You what did you really miss out on? I feel her. That I you mean, can't do okay, now. it's nothing that I can't do now. But I can't say that I didn't miss out on it if I did. You didn't miss out on nothing. You didn't miss out on. I'm trying to tell you. If I could go back and and redo it, because I ain't start making content until I left college. Mm-hmm. So it was like, ah, uh, but it was 2013. So that's that's kind of funny though. But if I, I could have did that shit in school, I would have did that nigga, shit. Nigga, what? Heartbeat. She's yeah. like, I got two channels, one and three. Yeah. But as a female, maybe she meant more balance. She could have been doing that, but still having a little more fun. Maybe that. that ain't was nothing. Need, it wasn't nothing nah. back there for you, but a bunch of little ass sick dicks. That's, that's it. You don't want that. You would have been partying. Right. You don't want that. Drunk. Them little t- teenagers, young drugs, and all that. You don't want none of that. You could. You had you. You great. No, I did good. You I'm, great. Ha- I'm you happy. You amazing. I am happy. <laughs> like I got the little boyfriend. I committed to him. I said, "This is the boyfriend." Okay, let's do it. Boy, we all like shit. If I could have went back, if I could have yeah. we looking at her like, "Nigga, you the you got the blueprint." Like, like, and she like, yeah. "I'm gonna tell my kids to loosen up." Do something I'm different. Like, no, don't do what I did. Uh, no. Shit. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna look at, hey, do what she did. You need to go, hey, go talk to Jayla. Right, you, right. you need a number. I know a person. I know somebody. I know in real life. Like shit. Damn, you took having yeah. fun. Like, girl, you're 
Hey. That was my thing. I was just focused on the fun and not mm. taking my, what I wanted to do seriously. I would do stuff and not stay consistent because I'm over here trying to have fun. So mm. now, like so you said. So, question. Let me get my interview bag then. Do you feel like, do you, do you understand what you got right now? Absolutely. You do? Mm-hmm. And you still would tell your kids to loosen up? Um, I had strict parents, so... That's a blessing. That's a blessing. I'm looking at, I'm like, honestly, I'm not gonna lie. Like, like after just hearing it, I'm just like, damn, like, that's super dope. Like, yeah. as much as niggas can joke about it, a lot of people don't have that discipline. No, you know what I'm saying? Like that, yeah. and it shows that it's, you need it. You feel me? Because you're super successful. You see the, the work paying off. You know what I'm saying? Like, people be, they be one foot in, one foot out, and they be bullshit. Yeah. Until they can't bullshit enough, and they like, I wish I could go back, and it's too late. You're a decade so, like, in. I'm a decade in. I'm on my second decade of content creation. Mm. So like, mm, I've been doing it. I've been got. I was on the same. Like, yeah. Crazy. crazy. Yeah. The, me, me too. The, the college vlogs was doing a hundred. But it's different. Views. Yeah. It is different. It's way different. No I would take No, I would take. I would take three hundred. Like, I would too. That's what I'm saying. I would take two hundred fifty thousand subscribers. That's what I'm saying. Off of anything. That's why I say it's different. Like yeah. I'm on my. I'm almost at a decade, but I'm like, is. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's a long way from there. I'm yeah, like, no, it's, yeah. but you, you, you on the way. Oh, you are on the we ain't about to do that. Nah, we ain't about to do that. But, 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 no, but listen, social <laughs> media, I, but listen, I got into social media when like we didn't know what it was, yeah. what it was. Mm. Like, you know, like I was one of the first ones to like do hair reviews on YouTube. So like, <sighs> it's just a different time. That's what I'm saying. That's, I ain't gonna lie. That's what got me into the um, AI stuff. Because I had to think about it, right? Because like my man, morning after he was talking about AI, like chat, GTP and all that. And first glimpse, the first thing I wanted to say was, I ain't fucking with this shit. But then I thought about it. Being an old nigga is the always the nigga that missed the turn. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to start messing with it. When you say AI, you mean like artificial intelligence? Yeah, mm-hmm. artificial intelligence. So like, at first I'm like, man, I'm not fucking with this. Uh, you know what I'm saying? But then I'm like, nah, that's probably what they would think about YouTube. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I ain't messing with this. You yeah. just internet stuff. I ain't messing with this. The niggas that was messing with it, time for MySpace. You know, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. nah, I yeah. ain't missing this. I ain't missing all on this one. Mm. Missing all on this one. YouTube is still hard for me though. Like it's it's hard for everybody. This is hard for me though. I do a lot of parody, so like I get flagged for oh, instrumental. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's like I'm a, I'm gonna give some game on the instrumentals. You gotta. So um, I don't know if you ever heard of freestyle platform on um, bars on i ninety five. They taught me this. You get the instrumental that you want to do, and but you get somebody bitch. to remake it. Oh, yeah, remake it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and then you won't get flagged. But see, the thing with that, though, is like, all right, I'm going to get somebody to remake the instrumental. Probably going to charge a fee, even if it's like $100, whatever. Pay the $100. I'm not making nothing off of that on the mm. back end. You know what I mean? Like, I got, I got a better I got a better tip. So, better. For $15 a month, you can pay for Epidemic Sound where you can did all the copyrighted music so you can use for your YouTube channel. Hey, 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 let me tell you something. You on my show. <laughs> she, can't, she can't give no free game. Don't, don't I come, can't give don't, the game. Don't come shit on he me. He needs some music. Hey, 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 I hey, know hey. where the music I don't like at. You, I don't like how you just did that. I, I, he needs some music. So she just dollars. dropped some, nah, that's some nah, that's She just dropped some bro. shit. She said, Let me, I got some better shit. I done, I done did that, though. I was paying niggas to remake instrumentals, but I'm yeah. like, yo, I'm, this is like, I'm not making nothing So t- t- tell us again. Yeah, Epidemic Sound is a whole site. It has the instrumentals. Like, I can't say the music can be kind of, you know, it's not. It's not our Nicki Minaj, it's not our Meek Mill, it's not yeah. our all, you know, mm-hmm. popular artists. Um, but you, for your YouTube videos, you can find what you need. Say less. Thank you so yeah, much. And it connects right to your YouTube channel, so it syncs, so mm-hmm. you won't get flagged. Hey, that's that's two decades that's in. Game. Man, no, that's, <laughs> yeah. no, that's no, game. No, yeah. I only got like 35 on there, but you know. It's, you know <laughs> well, you got how many? 35,000 on YouTube. Okay. But I don't, I don't post. It's time to get it going. Yeah. It's been at 35 for like. Four years. I don't want to be posting. Okay. Well, YouTube t- is hard. Today, bro. And this is a new day, new it's year. New day. Yeah, you're going to pull up and, and Thank you, fam. Because you want to just shit on me like that? You got YouTube? I do, but I don't use it. You didn't take a shot? Yeah, let's take a shot. That was how we're saying no, but whatever. Where? Yo, I-, I wanted to ask y'all this. Why is it Coleman Love, first family, but the Alphas love, the, the Deltas love the Alphas more? I, I only think the Deltas. I don't think it's Pass Deltas the love the Alphas. I got it. Boy, you right. said you don't think that 
I wish you would sit up here on the platform and lie like that. Deltas don't love the alphas per se. Oh my god. This is what it was, right? They treat us better. That's that's that part. Like the AKAs treat us better. The alphas the alphas want the AKAs. <laughs> but it's a lot of ugly ass alphas, right? We can't really give it to AKAs. There's AKAs a lot of fine ass us, AKAs. So therefore we was like, you know what, they ain't gonna respect us, we're gonna go rock with the deltas. So that's kind of how that whole thing. So basically, wait, 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 wait. Not like, no, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not, no, 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 Basically, they settled for what they can get. Y'all not settling for the ugly niggas. Look, 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 you're not, y'all not settling for the ugly niggas, though. Because not, we can't cross up. Y'all, y'all cutthroat. You know what I mean? Like, if we go approach it, maybe, if we go approach it, AKA, she might let us down nice because we fan, right? If an ugly ass alpha go approach a delta, we gonna get it. Like it's like, yo, you get your ass. They're all aggressive. They're they a little like, yo, get the fuck. You know you shouldn't have been coming over here talking to me. Like that's what it was. So why y'all why y'all let the alphas and not the bros? That's the real question. The alphas love me. Okay, they treat me. They treat me with respect. They make sure I got everything I need. I actually was doing my thing with an alpha. <laughs> you feel me? And you know you was like, <laughs> no, I don't feel you. Okay, but the bros, y'all just do too much. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like it's like a cockiness with y'all sometimes. Like we owe y'all something. And y'all do. Y'all can go ahead and who? Y'all know, do owe us something. Who? That way. Who owe you? Who what? D- but the case is that. Why? The ladies of DIC so owe us something. Why? Why? This will be family. Y'all owe us for 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 the um. Acres in the middle. I still work with y'all though. You know. You be showing with your ass out too. Or what? What? <laughs> you ain't seen that video on YouTube? <laughs> oh, I, I should have just been a blood. Fuck it. I'm blood, cap, but same thing, yo. I mean, <laughs> same sign. It is actually the same colors. <laughs> same colors. <laughs> shit, but, oh, yeah. So, do y'all, so but I feel like, I feel like the K's let a bros too, though. I wish you would lie. What's the best fraternity to you? Like, if you had to go, if you had to pick your husband, which fraternity would you dabble in first? Go ahead. Actually, put them in order. Yeah. Put them in order. Top, <laughs> top, top, what is it, five? Yeah. How top many fraternities? Five. Yeah. yeah, five. Ooh. We know all right, this is, all right, this is five. All right, so you start at four. I'm going to do the top three. Mm. Top three, okay. okay. All right. Start from the bottom, though. Uh-oh. Let's start from the bottom. The last three. What's the, what's the third one? In third uh, place. Third place is a Q. Yes. <laughs> you a hater. Bro, we above, yes. Yes, we're above you. I don't care. Second place is the Alpha. That's cool. I know where you're you going. You bet not say no mother. You already know. She gave me That's first disgusting. place is going to be a cap. Right. I need, okay. I need All somebody right. to do my hair reviews right. That's cool. That's cool. All right. No, 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 no. But it, there is some, you know, some little, you kind of cappers. But no, no, no. I, I want the man. Oh, what you say? Huh? What you, what you talking about the uh, cookie? T- what is the shit called? The cat cappers. The cats. What's the cookie yeah. thing? The cookies. <laughs> It's like a cookie. Oh, <laughs> oh the ookie cookie. Are they sweet? <laughs> what is it called? They, they, the, the they got the no, Atlanta. What's the cookie thing? The, no. They have sassy. You, no, it's something they had sassy. to do with a cookie. No, 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 no. Now y'all know what I'm talking about. No, I, don't know. Talking about. No, I promise you when I moved here, I've seen the they... most sassiest noose in my life. In the last one. I'm like, it's like we're bad bees together. No, I was really I don't think that's a Greek thing though. I think that's just I'm like, I don't want to be a bad bee with I mean, yes, I want to cap it, but I don't want to do this with you. Nah, and that's out here. I don't want have a, if I have an Heavy. attitude, I don't need you to get an attitude with me back. Babe. So, so cap is number one for you because you say what? But if but, I have an attitude, I don't need you to get an attitude but with they, me that's back. You, you said that's your number one. No, but why is cap right. number one for you? Like, well. Um, you know, in general, I think that cappas are just more sweeter guys. Like, yeah. so compared Facts. to the cute. Facts. Oh yeah, I'm cool. Sweet. Yeah, we're talking about they sweet, all right? Not, no. Okay, but not that type okay. of sweet. But like, they do try to please the woman. You know? Man, that hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. You asked me a question. Let her answer the question. Okay. So when we talk about romantic and romance and stuff, are they more closer to that than the other guys? Now, all of y'all actually suck. I'm going to let y'all know. Y'all not the best when it comes to pleasing a woman, romanticizing a woman and all of that. Y'all actually oh. suck. So if we're just talking about closer to the needle of getting that treatment, Q's going to be on the far that mm. side and Kappa's gonna be on this side and you try to get one that kind of got can i get a little bit of q but a little bit of kappa <laughs> like, I, I, I don't want too much kappa i don't know i don't want too much q <laughs> damn that's so get like alpha that's like alpha to me right sound like alpha yeah, so like then the the al- that, but y'all saw how i rated it though i said kappa alpha q and who in the middle the mm. alpha is in the middle but then y'all got who got what 
What they got? I know one of our presidents was stealing money, but besides that, what? <laughs> but y'all did the brown poke for y'all. I don't trust neither one of y'all. Y'all was doing a brown paper bag test and all that shit. Y'all racist, both of y'all. Brown paper bag test? I never did that in my life. I don't even know what that Not is. Not y'all, but y'all found this what? Oh, now you don't know. Uh, I don't know what that is. Now you don't know what, now, oh, you don't know what it? Enlighten us. Oh my God, okay. I mean, big brother. I mean, <laughs> She might get enlightened. We cannot help what society has. I want to know your rank too, though. My rank? Yeah, yeah top three. In third place. That's hard because I'll be over. In third place. In, in third place. Okay. okay, I'm GDI over here, but no. Facts. If I had to choose, I I would say. I don't know. I, that's hard. Like she said. Oh, I, brother! <laughs> in third all right, place. All right, all right, all right. Rela third place. Noops, again, especially when I moved to Atlanta, they all give sassy to me. Um, so Atlanta noops. Atlanta. So that yo was like yo, specifically yes, like Atlanta. Yo. Like yo, yeah. Wait, they be so sassy. Like sad. yo, and yo, then baby. Even, honestly, the ones I you know was around on campus with me, they was kind of corny to me. I don't know, no shit. Yeah. But no, they you can give, catch a good looking you know one depending on what school. Know, okay, yeah, okay. So yeah, that'll be third. Second will be. It's a tie between y'all alphas and, and bros. I'm going to just say y'all necking it. Neck I, and neck. I, I, I what's, your I, dislike, what's your dislike about cues and then what's your dislike about alphas? I don't know. I love, to me personally, with alphas, they give me more business yeah. oriented. Yeah. Uh, with My bros, bad. it could go either way. Yeah. Like some yeah. of them are corny to me, but then some... You know, give me the manly vibes. They be on their shit. They Some just creative. be too. What my experience? They've just been wow. They just been like that. The whole organization is just like let's be wow yeah. guys. Oh, they trying to. Oh, oh, they trying to. I got something yeah. they love. Wow. Bro, that's crazy. The oh, whole just trying to like organization is you know just I mean? like woo woo woo. <laughs> At all times. So yeah, you know we're gonna go with alphas first, and Thank then bros second. <laughs> Yo, wow, that's crazy. Oh, that's crazy. All right, top top, top sororities, top three. Um, yeah. All right. We talking about what, like relationship or like? Man, you know we talking about man, top three. No matter. <sighs> I'm going off of experience and experience. No, I can't. I can't. No, I can't. I'm going off experience. But all right, so third. Third, we're gonna go with uh, we're gonna go with, with AKA Alpha Kappa Alpha Sword Incorporated. First fam, oh wow, third, not in a bad way. Though. No, 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 not no, a bad way. Third, not a bad way. It's a bad way. Third, third, not a bad way. Third? Third? <laughs> not a bad way. All right, not so what's number two? Number two. I'm, I'm talking about my my personal experience. All right, so number two. Like when I when I crossed, we don't need to hear explanation, man. Okay, just number two. Us. Give us an explanation on the back end. All right, third, number two. Number two. Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated. Mm. Number two. Ooh, number what you putting as one? Up. Right. Sir? I'm curious to know who number one Me is. Me too. Me too. Number this is one. crazy. Only because they're the biggest freaks. Sigma Gamma Rho <laughs> is the biggest freaks. You know what's crazy? Okay. You know I, sound, crazy? I sounded crazy. No, no, no. You know what's crazy? What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm hey. mad at that. Hey. Hey, hey. I, I, I be telling the SG Rose all the time about Sharon Cage. Not so they have to make up in, in, in their womanness with. No, 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 wait, no, wait, no, 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 no. You not... said they was more freaks, so I'm trying to understand. They are more. I mean, it's not what they had to make up for it. It's like, I feel like SG Rose already kind of get like a. Ah, like nobody really care about them. You feel so me? So then like, they have to be freaky in bed to make up for mm -hmm. it. No, it's kind of like you got to get to know one to be like, you know what? Y'all actually. All right. Yeah. Why don't you have to actually get to know them and say, y'all hey. all right? Hey. You never heard of somebody and be like, you heard of their reputation, but then you get to know them and be like, so-and-so was saying this, but. I'm going to be, 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 I'm be corny. I'm going to be corny, but real. If I put them first, I can understand, but it's because it's for a different reason. I'm sorry, but it's just my experience. I've actually saw. Some SG Rose, you know, none of the organ, none of the D nine is well. I don't know why Rose, but you know, Omega Psi Phi is a non pleasure, non hazing yeah, fraternity, same. right? Mm -hmm. I would assume every, for everybody. Definitely. But I seen some um, SG Rose. 
Never seen nothing like that in my life. Nothing like what? I think it's, you probably wouldn't know what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it goes <laughs> without saying. You know. Hey, they just men being men. They not men. <laughs> no, y'all. No, I'm no. I'm saying I just seen some. I seen what some. What did you see? I know what he's talking about. I'm not gonna lie. What they be doing? I didn't. Oh, that's what I'm saying. So if it's it was number one, it would be the reason because that done, probably was the craziest. You done seen some shit that you ain't. I've ever seen. And I mean, ever. Not even, if I'm not even separate. I'm some Physically. Old, ever. Yeah. Y'all like, talking about physical things. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, that's my opinion. We but if we talking, talking about, about loving, if we talking about loving. Husband material. Oh, we talking about loving? So if I, if I had to be real, right? Yeah. For, for fun's sake. Mm. It will go. <clears throat> As she roll, because they got to be there. AKAs, because, you know, they got that. I feel like a lot of the AKAs fit the stereotype and be real. I'm keep it 100. I'm keep it 100. They fit the. Now, you, what, you don't what, know what the stereotype is? What's the stereotype? You know Let us know. I want to know yeah. what the stereotype is. Yeah. She just want to hear it. Yeah, what is it? What is, is it? AKAs, a lot, they say AKAs are pretty, right? Okay. I'm not going to lie. A lot of that organization fit this. Like you say, Brother Wild fit the stereotype. K's fit the stereotype. Um, but also with the stereotype, you gotta deal with what come with it. Mm. So they should be third, low key. Because everybody be chasing them. A lot of people be successful too. They're gonna kill me on this. Yeah, they're gonna, yeah, they gonna yeah. Yeah. be successful. <laughs> they're gonna kill me. For real. Yeah, they're gonna kill you. <laughs> It's okay. for content, content over everything. It is content. Like when I, when I crossed, I, uh, niggas AKA be, was my, was niggas my be, special gift. All I'm saying is niggas Yo, it be was a gift. It was a gift to you? Mm. You got a gift, you got an AK as a gift? I mean, shit. Shit in me. I mean, shit in me. Don't ever do I, that in your life. I mean, there's <laughs> enough of them for everybody. <laughs> I'm out of here. Okay, who's the number one? Who's the right. number one? Who's your number, number one? Number one would be DSC. Oh, only because, right. only because. But I'm corny though, so I don't. You don't get no brownie points for this, right? Because I ain't never get no love from no devil. No, how you gonna do it? Like you gonna give a number one spot and then you gonna not even I'm do it, right? No, I no. Y'all got number two and I still get y'all shade. I'm just being real. So how you you can't do that to the number one spot. What you mean? Oh, why can't I? It's my choice. It's my choice. Yeah. It's my choice. My top three. You I did told that to you. The, you did that to the number it, one. If it was any other way, it would be Essie Rose number one. You if should it have said it on the campus a little bit. Yeah. Okay, if, okay. If it was okay, any okay. other way, Essie Rose would be number one, right? Okay. But if we talking about like loving or whatever, Delta's would be number one because I'm corny. Because Q and Delta. Delta, I, yeah, yeah, Delta showed me way so more you, love than any other. That's who you want to marry because of the stereotype. Like, those nah, I don't want to marry nobody. Nah. Yeah. I'm married GDI. Yeah, my my girl is home right now. <laughs> I'm, mm. saying, I'm saying, if we, for sake of content, Delta will be number one because I'm a Q. Mm -hmm. And it's just corny. You put some. Cute ducks yeah. and stuff. It's just corny. I used to yeah. That's not time. corny. That's cute. Yeah. Oh, Stop. Cute. Oh, I, think okay. I used to say that all the time. Yeah, now that I'm old, it's cute. Like, like at the, the wedding, like the. That's what I'm y'all neck and neck for me. Yeah. It's K E W T. It's Fire cute. Nice. It's Fire nice. Fire cute. Nice. Fire it's nice. Cute. Yeah. Love, right? Ain't no goddamn coma love. Nah. But like, I feel like. Delta's never showed me love ever. AKA's don't ever give me love. Delta's <laughs> always, I always get love from Delta. K's always used to show me love. That's crazy. But I feel like it would make sense though. Maybe you ain't show DST love. Mm. Mm. Yo, this is the worst. I don't know why I did this. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I did this. This don't, don't even make know. sense. I don't know. Kill. My brand is done. <laughs> no, never. No. If I had a good brand, it's done. They're gonna no. kill me like this nigga is. Shit. Nah, yeah. No, the clickbait clips that you got from this is crazy. crazy. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. This freak. <laughs> yeah, Kappa's sweet. Like, bro, you going to clip oh, all that shit. Gonna it's gonna... I threw up the yo in the first yeah, two minutes. Yo, of the... Like, they're not going to know nothing. Yeah, this is crazy. Yeah. So, 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 outside of, like, on some real shit, though. Just, and, like, coming to an end. How, like, how is everything, though? Like, do y'all, like, outside of the freak, like, Greek stuff, like, how, how y'all feeling? I wouldn't be me if I ain't asked that question. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Outside of the Greek stuff, how we feeling? Like everything, just like just how y'all oh, feeling? Oh man, you uh, you want to go first? <laughs> uh, right now, and where I'm at, like drained, bro. Mm. I, I would say I'm mm -hmm. drained, man. Mm. Drained. 
all types of drain. Just content wise, I feel burnt out. I just mm. feel like I'm I'm doing everything on my own. Ten years in, mm. bro, I'm 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 drained. I'm tired. Mm. I'm tired, bro. I, I can't even I can't even sit here and fake the funk. And keep going. <laughs> your time's but it is though. Like your it's time not, is, is soon. But like yo, it's only soon because later is so far away. I'm gonna wait because I can. I'm going to wait. No, nah, we was just talking about this before the podcast started. Like, honestly, I remember I started strong with my comedy thing and, like, was going real hard around 2019-ish. Then the pandemic hit. Then I got lazy and I moved to Atlanta two years ago. And I'm thinking, oh, I'm going to hop into acting classes. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. And I'm thinking, by year two, I'm going to book at least something. And it's like, mm. it's just really people, you think you about to I don't know. You you know that, that, that question in college, where do you see yourself 10 years from now? I used to be like, oh, winning a Grammy, like mm. best actress, but it's very draining. Um, my creativity is no longer there really for content creation on Instagram. I'm just kind of on a business wave right now. I just really want financial wealth. Mm. Like that's kind of where I'm at right now. And I feel like once I get there, maybe my creativity will come back, but I am still pursuing the acting thing and, but adulting is is ghetto. But it's ghetto here. Jayla, are you? Um, I feel like what I thought adulthood would look like is completely different. Mm. Um, I have felt this burnout stage, mm. and I feel like I recently got on TikTok, and I'm kind of getting my like, like okay, mm. like. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, I'm getting a little. Back. I'm getting a little bit more win. You know, like I go on live on TikTok, I be setting it off. I I got suspended two times in in the past week. <laughs> for what? Right. I heard her, her live be lit. Like people really be waiting for her to come back. Yeah, they be mm. waiting. We get ready on there. I do my makeup, get the outfit ready. Mm. They'll come to the club with me in the live mm. or whatever. They they be on the live. So oh, before I good. go, I'm curious. With so many stories similar to ours right now i'm not going to say theirs do you find it hard to find a, a good circle because that can be draining when you're not in that space mm -hmm. yeah a lot of people don't understand me i get prejudged a lot i mean i already have like a lot of followers and status status but like for me i'm just like i'm jayla like i'm a i'm regular like that's what i think although that's not what it really is but is your circle life. like you though like it's just circle more people that's like super successful. Everything is not everything. Their business is going really good, or is it more so of tired, burnt out? Like how how is your circle? Mm. Um, I feel like everybody right now is like working hard to scale. Mm. You know, we're all trying to get to this. Like, where where is this like wealth part? That's like, ooh, it's we're good, mm. but nobody is good. Everybody is continuing to work, like. Even the most people that you look online, it's like, oh, this just like hearts and rainbows and ice cream every day. No, it's not. Mm. That's what they put out. I work really hard, and I know my content looks very glamorous and glam, but on the daily, I came here from a photo shoot. I had two meetings today. One, I was about to take me out. I said, Lord, help me, because mm. I got to go into this photo shoot. I got to fix my mood. I got a podcast to do. Mm. I can't, that energy at 2 o'clock can't be here at 8 o'clock. I love this conversation because, like, I told you I wanted to, like, do this to have a little fun and get mm. loosened up. But, like, it, it wouldn't be me if I ain't had this, like, conversation because it's real. I feel like a lot of us feel burnt, though. Mm. You get what I'm saying? But, like, I'm in circles where it's working, right? And I have to check myself, like, my reality ain't everybody's reality. And I don't want to be that one in the room that's messing it up. Right. You get what I'm saying? But when I go home, I feel like, y'all, mm -hmm. I ain't even going to lie. I feel like in the black community, we put on, everybody puts on a strong face right now. Mm -hmm. Like, it's very hard. Social media at this time is, we don't know what the next thing is. We right. don't know. Everything keeps changing. So mm. since I've been in the industry for so long and I have already seen all the changes, I already know new people coming in. I'm like, it's a lot. Mm. I mean, every six months, every three months is something else to, we got to do the reels. We got to do, the, the photos are in. Now what's the reels? Now, not Instagram, TikTok. No, not TikTok. Now we got the YouTube shorts. Now 
do the long form content too. Jiggle and shake to this song. Like it's a lot to keep up. And then you gotta stay consistent. You gotta put out like three videos a day, they saying. Like just something on it daily. And it's like, okay, I'm still gotta work. I still people got kids. You still gotta come back to kids. Like then you want your love life. You maybe if you don't have kids, you want kids. And it's how, like, how where do you date? The where do I date at? Yeah. Like, how do I add in dating into right. the mix of all of this? And I just feel like being hyper visual on social media, like I'm already, you can already see what I'm doing. Like it cancels out half the guys. They're intimidated. Like, I don't know. Yeah. I'm mm-hmm. like, yeah. but I'm supposed to find this husband in this like life. Mm-hmm. I'm like, is it here in Atlanta? Is it here in Atlanta? Fuck no. Mm. I'm going to tell you that. Stop. No. I love, stop it. Now I'm not gonna lie. I love, I love, I love you. That's gonna sound crazy. Hey, yo, whoa! <laughs> you love me? <laughs> no. You gotta cut that no. out. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, I love all of y'all, my brothers and sisters. But I, 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 I love your attitude towards life because even like when we joking about the Greek thing, you, you remain you. I love that. Like mm. so many other people would be like, they want to be like, like they want to be something they not. You feel mm. me? I love that she was like, no matter, no matter how many jokes I threw out, some people say slur, whatever. He was like, nah, like, what is that? Right. Mm-hmm. You feel me? Like, yeah. so many other people want to be something they not. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? And like, I feel like that's why you winning though. To be honest, you get what I'm saying? Because like, you are you. Yeah. And you could tell, like, you could, you could, uh, you could tell. That's, that's a fact. You yeah. feel me? You're like, always gonna win because you can be you. Like, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Like, that's the one thing I definitely want to give you respect for that because like. No, like even the conversation talking about Greeks and shit. You're like, no, nah, I don't know what that is. Like, what's that? Yeah, like it's what cat. you trying to call me? Yeah, like, yeah. that's not my name. That's not what it is. That's not whatever you thought in your mind. You can keep that over there. Mm. But so yeah, I, think- I, I can never get into beef about it because it's like y'all gonna let that switch you. When I got this camera and we can talk to TikTok and everybody else, y'all gonna let these wannabes tell you what we got going on? Mm. Please. Yeah, <laughs> I think I think um. We just gotta keep work. Like we know, we know, right? Yeah. yeah. And it's like, it's like, it's funny. It's funny because I, I feel like it's hard to relate to us because not relate, but it's hard to talk to us because we know what we gotta do. But I, I do think we need the space to be able to just communicate it, right? Because like we don't. I'm assuming I can talk for y'all. We don't need no advice. We know what we gotta do. Right. Keep going. Be consistent. We know that. Mm-hmm. But sometimes you need people to just understand where you're coming from and where you at. Yeah, you get what I'm trying to say. Yeah, just no, be able to talk about it, like and like you said, it. it depends on your circle. Like I feel like I don't know me personally. I don't have a big Atlanta creative circle, so maybe that's another reason why. At home, I knew a lot of people, so and it was in comedy, like in my field, so that kind of like pushed me to put out more. But when you're not around that, it's kind of is hard. We all was from somewhere else. We moved to Atlanta. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's crazy. Yeah. How how is that? Like, is it? Atlanta ain't what it hyped up to be, but I mean, I like being away from home. I do enjoy that, and I do again, like you said. I mean, I still look at life on a positive note, you know. So yeah, I do too. I, I just feel I, I like Atlanta. I just don't know where else I would go. But the one thing that bothers me about when it comes to content is like I might be in a funk, and I'm like, you know what, man, I got the, enough energy and motivation to make this video, and then I post that shit. And there'd be motherfuckers in the comment who just be like against the shit or got some negative shit to say. And I'm like, yo, like I saw a post today was like, before you make a negative comment, like think about what that's going to do. You know what I mean? Because like, if you don't know what somebody been going through, like, you could have been going through a lot and you built up enough courage. Like, you know, I'm going to post this real. Mm-hmm. Somebody going to say, you know, your shoe untied. Like, bitch, we're not even talking. Like, look at the, the work itself. Right. You know what I mean? You don't got to. So that'd be my thing. I'm, I'm very controversial, but I like that. You know what I mean? Like, I. I strive and live off that because I know that's an audience that people they want to see that they want to see that real nasty whatever you want to call this shit. Yeah. For me, I think to be honest, I'm gonna keep it hundred. I think Atlanta is what it's hyped up to be. I think because I'm a little older, I miss the wave. How old are you? I'm 31. Okay. Yeah, I'm a little old, but I think because I'm a little older, and it's not even because I'm older. My lifestyle. I have a girl. I got a daughter. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got a daughter? Right. I got a 13-year-old. Like, and I got one on the way. I can say a that. A 13-year-old? Oh, yeah. Congrats. Congrats. Hey. So, like, I'm about to say, by the time this come out, I can say, yeah, like, 
I got one on the way. I got a 13 year old. Like my lifestyle is not even conducive of what it like how I could make Atlanta work for me. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm trying to say? Oh, yeah. No, yeah. I said that if I moved yeah. out here right after college. What? Oh yeah. It's oh, it's lit. It would have like, been lit. Nah, like Atlanta is what it like. I'm not gonna. It's Black Hollywood. It, it is. But it's you like when the you connection. Out you got the you connection. Tired of this, right. the, the, the party lifestyle, yeah. the networking lifestyle. Like that's when it's kind of like all right. I'm, but that's why you. That's uh-huh. why you benefit because right now, she, like tonight is Wednesday. You I already outside. know the spot. I can mm-hmm. pull it. I don't got no kids. It's kind of mm-hmm. like yeah, if I'm, I'm not house, too. T- I'm going if to I'm not too tired after what I just did today and this, it's like I can go out. Like you know, and I think that. That's also another reason why it's kind of hard for me to like, kind of like meet guys. It's just like, my life is free. Like I'm free. Mm-hmm. I'm free as a bird. Let's get on the plane. Let's go. Yeah. Let's razzle dazzle it. Right. Like y'all are giving very dry and boring. Who they say you look like? Who? You never heard nothing before? <laughs> Who? You look like a uh, diamond from Crime what you like the way I rock I'm with and, it. and wave and I can see that. I can see that. I can see that a little bit. Oh. <laughs> so you definitely gonna you gonna pop out here. You know what I mean? Yeah. But you already yeah. got your own shit going on, and then they might think you know what I mean. But I think for me, I think <clears throat> like I'm over a lot of things. Like when I first started, like I was telling my friends, like I'm growing into my pride, and what I mean by that is the podcast is getting a little successful, right? Mm-hmm. So now, like when I like when I first started, I'm DMing people; they're not answering. Mm-hmm. So for me, I'm gonna keep DMing them. It's different now, cause now niggas are saying I want to do it, but they bullshitting. Mm-hmm. So now I'm mad. Like now I'm like I'm not about to like. It's different when like I DM somebody and they don't answer. So like I I keep DMing them a hundred times, but now I'm talking. Like I got niggas numbers. Niggas is responding, mm-hmm. and they not they just not men in their words. Like I literally. I ain't gonna say mm. her name. I was upstairs. I did an interview with somebody. The girl made me picky promise. She's like a picky promise because I, I usually make niggas shake on it. She still ain't answering. Mm. So it's like it's weird, like because I used to I used to have pride in not having pride. Like I used to like tell people like, man, why I'm so successful? I don't have no pride in this. Like it ain't no pride. Like I just DM people, yeah. and I see myself growing into this the opposite because it's like now. I can show you five five star celebrities that's like, yo, I'm fucking with you, mm-hmm. but you ain't fucking with me because you playing in my face. Right. I'd rather nigga not. De- I'd rather you not answer. Like, mm-hmm. like it's crazy the space I'm in now. So it's like, it's just weird. So I can relate to you. It's just it's mm-hmm. weird, bro. It's just crazy right now. But like, that's, that's, that's why I wanted to do this because like we could just. That's have why I wanted fun. to pull up too though. Cause remember I was like, yo, mm-hmm. old girl wanted to to film. She had to push the time back, but like. I gotta be a man of my word. You know what I mean? If, if I ain't pull up, you would have made it work. Yeah, I would have made it work. You know what I mean? But where does that leave your vision? Even the first time we did a podcast, somebody was supposed to pull up. I ain't pull up. You know what I mean? So yeah. it's like, you gotta be a man of your oh, word. Oh, you a man of your word, though? For sure. Yeah, I, no, no, I can't no, no, no. What happened to my event? Oh. Oh, yeah. No, you fake, bro. Yeah. No, 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 no. You, you mean, I might have forgot. Oh, you fake. Forgot. The sickle cell event, so, right? Yes. But you know what's funny about that? Funny. I like so. I apologize first of all. I apologize, front and center. But I've been trying to do a sickle cell show since then. But I've been. <laughs> what, what you no, but you nah, was you the, like you was motivated. Yeah, and I told it. you get that other guy. That yeah, other nice. Actor. Yeah. I, like I'm, I'm, I'm just. It's hard right now. I know, I know. No, no, no. Like no cap. But I'm just saying. I guess now you, you kind of can relate for the people. Maybe they have intentions on doing it. So and then that's what. In. So. Everybody got a lot going on. Yeah, so and that's what helped it, me. I don't take it personal. Like that's yeah. what helped. So that's what helped me. Yeah. Like you're right. Like that's because I'm not no, I'm not oblivious. That's what helped me understand because yeah. it's so many people in my DM that I don't respond to. Mm-hmm. It's so many people in my DM that I, I mean well, but I I might not do well. You mm-hmm. feel me? Mm-hmm. So I so I can understand like it, I'm I'm probably just not as important to them as mm-hmm. other people. Mm-hmm. Like. Other people ain't as important to me, but mm-hmm. what I will say is I kept you in mind, though. What no, that? I that kept time? you in mind. No, remember that time you was on. I could have had a million people on the show today. And I called you. Damn. So you just replaceable. I Wait, guess. what? <laughs> That's supposed to be a good thing. How you make that a negative thing? <laughs> I could have called a million other people, but I called you. I like, thought that was making that, special. No, that, that was the reasoning for not keeping your word. 
I apologize. So did you, ask, did you ask anybody else before you asked her? That's why you don't mess with the bros? Yeah. Bro, I just invited you to my platform. To- and you was on live the other day, and I was like, man, I invited you to my comedy show. You didn't invite me. Then I had to go get the screenshot, yeah. send it to you. You liked it. You hearted the actual flyer of the show. So all them pinky promises. Oh, oh yeah, I did. Bro, I'm lit right now. Nah, bro, we ain't going to Right, so he needs to be more understanding with people. Yeah. That well, other people, do exactly. Come up, even if they pinky promise. do have other priorities in life. How many times we talked about that? Oh, look, defensive. How many times we talking about it? Right, mm-hmm. no accountability. Talk- right. right. How many right. times? How many, how many times we talked about it? We talked about it enough. We talked about it one time. It nah. was enough. It was one time. Now nah, I see why the bros did an interview. How, how many, you know what I mean? Nah, Y'all I is crazy. Nah, how, many ta- how many times we talked about your comedy show? One time. No. So I got. How many times you have to tell me to be on the show? Why do you have to tell somebody multiple times? Exactly. No, all I'm saying is, all I'm no, saying no, no, no. is, I apologize. First of all, leave me alone. I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> all I'm saying is, I have a reason to be mad at the people I'm mad at. Because this ain't just a one thing. Mm. I, we talked about it one time. Okay. Invite me again. I, I'm going to come. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I had five shows that weekend. Oh, wow. he's he's a a troll. Troll. you're not you're not making this. He's right. a troll. Oh, yeah, I had wow. five shows, two Friday, two Saturday, one. Wow. You invited me to five shows. I'm about to. I see whatever. You invited show, me to five shows. Oh. What did the text say? I don't know. I oh, don't worry. I got it right here. <laughs> hold on. I think she put a receipt up. Hold on. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. There was on. five shows. Jay Hill. Hold on. Here we go. Right here. The fly. It say, if you and like your lady or whoever you want to come out this weekend to check me out, let me know. I will put you on my list. You hearted it. It was five shows? Is that hard? Yeah, the flyer. 7 30, 10 30, Saturday, 7 and 10, but Sunday, he 8 30. You today. All right, maybe I shouldn't even have <laughs> But here I am with you. I just got to wait my you. turn. I just got to wait my turn. Thank y'all. Yeah. Thank y'all. Next show, though, you got to pull up. Thank y'all for, ju- for, for charging it to my brain and not my heart. Okay. <laughs> I'm charging it to these niggas' hearts. Fuck these niggas. I'm What's sorry. That I'm a Gemini. Oh. 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 That makes sense. Wait, all, so y'all, nah, wait, yeah. what? No, I forgive you, bro. What are you? Scorpio. Scorpio. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh What's my god. Like? You, you really should have been enjoying your college life. But. Facts. All the, you like funny. Yeah, but guess what? Yeah. But guess what? I dated a Scorpio, so he was very like, oh, "You're yeah, mine. Yeah, you're yeah. staying in the room." So what's Wait, your are sign? You October or November Scorpio? Though? November 11, 11. Okay. What's your What's your sign? I'm a Leo. What's your sign? Libra. Oh, yeah, we here. We here. Oh, so I'm about to go Delta, <laughs> Alpha. Y'all love each other. Nah. I mean, My Delta and Alpha is five good. letters, you know. Huh? Delta and Alpha are both five letters. Come on. Together, Come on. make 10. Come on, I got bars. <laughs> Damn, y'all just made me feel bad. When the next um, event? September. It's every September. That's Sickle Cell Awareness Month. I thought you were about to ask. When the next time you got Sickle Cell? Right? You, yo, can you? All right, September. I, well, I do. Listen, September. Oh, no, no, nah, nah, listen. September, give me four shows. Everybody, sickle cell conversation on my platform. You can have all the proceeds. Mm. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. We gonna see. I made it up. We 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 got that recorded. Yeah, yeah. no, no, he, he, no. He texted him, told him to turn the camera <laughs> off. <laughs> yeah, cut I texted him, turn the, cut the audio, turn, turn cut the audio off. Cut no, the audio. I feel you. What you saying as far as I truly you do apologize. Sometimes take it personal. I don't reach out to, you know. People, celebs who have sickle cell and stuff like that, and they actually reach back out and send the same. And it's like, dang. I don't <laughs> like around. this. Did you follow up? Hold up. I don't right, like this. That's going to be part of your story. Did you story, follow though. up? Did you follow up? I did. I think I did. But listen, nah, you you but listen, but listen y'all, you have to have roadblocks in life. Like, yeah, people no, are going to say no. I, and it, it shapes you as a person. It you makes you keep moving you. forward. I understand. Because if, if we always get what we want, we can never grow and, and, and learn and get to where we... It's, I always feel like it's a lesson in everything. When, yeah. the, when a door is shut... Although we don't be knowing why for real, we mm-hmm. be like, why not me? Like, I'm the best person mm-hmm. for this. Like, mm-hmm. why didn't this connect or why didn't this align? But it do really be in our benefit. So I feel like now I just be trying to, like, be like, listen, if it was meant to happen, it if it was happen. meant to go that way, then it would have. No, honestly, like I said, I, that's why I, I didn't have no shade. Like, this is all jokes. Yeah. But I've learned that a long time ago. Like, is when it I all got jokes? turned down several times. Is it all jokes? It is. I'm just saying. I just have to remind you at the end of the day. So what I will say is, you right. Okay. <laughs> I apologize again. But you, I've, the people I'm talking about. It's a million reminders. For real. Right. They like, it's a million. They're going to be begging you to be like, on look, like, But they probably got more stuff going on. Nah, maybe. I mean, nah, it, a you lot know? of that shit just be like, I feel like I'm bigger than that. Yeah. yeah. I feel like I'm like, better than that. If I'm free, I'm free type yeah. vibe. Like, 
But whatever, man. I, I thank y'all for pulling up today. This is great. I think um Are you? I like <laughs> What's the what's the alpha thing? A five? That shit lame. That's what I'm saying, bro. I ain't know them niggas ain't really have no like you know I ain't a lot of bros got juice. Y'all got hella shit. We got juice. Yeah. But everybody got hella shit. Like, but even the six, But becoming like, the bros. I know. Looking I back it. on it, that shit is gay. I'm sorry. Tell us. She's like, what is going on? Yeah, yeah. Mark is like, yo, chill. <laughs> yeah, <she's> like, chill. <laughs> like, nigga, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm just like, if you think about the things you had to do. Yeah, no, I think all that shit be like. Like, that, bro, bro, you had to. Yeah, no, bro. Bro. I don't know what they done told y'all. We'll talk after. We th- <laughs> hey, yo. Okay. I mean. <laughs> if that ain't gay, I mean, bro. Yeah, though. And, 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 and. <laughs> like, yo, what we doing? I'm like, yo. Yo, what? if that ain't, yo. Looking back. Look like, like, yo, what you doing? Like, bro, we, I'm looking like. Why are we doing this? Bro, why am I, like, why am I why? doing that? Like, oh if that ain't the weirdest thing <laughs> like, ever, bro, bro. yeah, bro. But, like, once you start, it's like, you Who, can't. But think about it. And to think we was hyped to do it. <laughs> no, we don't know. I didn't know, bro. I was hyped to do it. I like, yeah. No yeah, a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nigga, yeah. Yeah, all that. Oh, like, yo, what, bro? Like, Nigga, I went to the country. I went to motherfucking hundred. Like, yeah, Century Club. Century, like, so, like, bro, who, I, I just want to know who created that. When did that happen? That's Niggas a good, had to be sick. You're talking about back in 1906, they was doing that. That shit was gay. That was they So that was on your mind, like, hey, I'm trying to bring these brothers together. Yeah, and yeah, you got to. Yeah. Hold on, wait. I have another question. Okay, <laughs> what about how y'all feel about as far as, as far as y'all know, like, and I feel, <clears throat> and I feel they say, oh yeah, connect with the with the Soros or you know your frat brothers in your field, like. Oh, I could tell you. How do you feel? Yeah. I so 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 wish that, like, I want to. I want to yeah. be like, because I feel like that's a that's a lane. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's just. I don't know. I don't know if it's excuses. I just. Do you ever met? I want you ain't met Ricky Smiley? Huh? You ain't met Ricky Smiley? Mm-mm. No. I probably DM'd him. I probably DM every lit bro you think of. Mm. You think of. Jack? Mm. Nigga, I met him. I did a commercial with him. He gave me his number. Let yeah. me not get in trouble. Yeah, no, 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 no. Mm. He did me the same way, though, one time, though, too, though. If you ever want to, you can make fun of me whenever. La, da, 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 da. Reached out, tried to get him in some shit. He never responded back. It's like, I can't fight the yeah. nigga. I think a lot of people kind of take you being in a sorority fraternity like, oh, well, shoot, you should be, man, you should be connecting with your sisters and this and that. But it's like, I mean, it's still, again, I mean, you can, but it's still like. It works it, when it works. It and works it doesn't when it doesn't. doesn't, when it doesn't. Yeah. Yeah. Back to your question, what you said, though, before we started. <laughs> why you feel like ain't no, who is, a, who, who do y'all know is the most prominent Greek Q? comedian? Oh, Greek, period. Like, yeah, like who? Oh, it's a lot. You got, uh. Who? His name D.L. Eagley. He's, he's, a, he's a Q, right? We got shit. It's a lot. Steve Harvey's I'm a saying, Q. But like, Shaq is a Q. Mm. Okay. Um, Ricky Smiley's the bro. Let me, let me, let me rephrase the question. It was once, it was once upon a time where I was like the hottest Greek comic. Oh, I think, I just feel like we probably just too old. You still and on social media though. No, not nah, like I so honestly, is is somebody content got shared to our chat today, like the other day, and niggas called him corny. Nigga, oh, I, I, I forgot his name. I think I know you talking about. Yeah, so it's like we it's probably are those he type a, of He a bro. He, he a bro, yeah. yeah. But like niggas like bro, I hate this nigga content. But it's like <laughs> I mean, I think times change. You feel me? Like mm. you can't yeah, yeah. You feel me? When we was young, we probably looked like they got, I'm pretty sure some young bros that look at him like, yo, that's nigga lit. But overall, Damn. y'all happy y'all join at the end of the day? I mean, absolutely. me personally, I'm still yeah, absolutely. You satisfied. Happy? You happy? Yeah, I'll go I back and do it again if I had shit. to. You hate it? If I, I had to go back. I'm going to my letters right now. No, you wouldn't. If you, had, if you go, had to go back, would you redo it? I mean, you could denounce your letters. I would denounce my letters right now. I'm Christian. Seriously? That's what people do. That's what people do. And Are I, you being for real? I'll be confused. Nah, it's content over everything. It's going to be a clip, though. Yeah. Oh, okay. But um, <laughs> I'll, I'll be confused. And I'm going to make a clip. They're going to hate me. I don't care. Yeah. But nah, in real life, I love it. I think um, it was one of the best decisions I made. Okay. Like, I met, a lot, like, so, like, my brother right here. Like, mm. even if I'm not as close to the bros, I got fat. Like, this is my brother. Like, you right. mean, like, outside of this, forget them letters. Mm, exactly. Like, this is my brother. Like, blood kicking it. I would I would have never met him with that. You feel me? I would have never I would have never met him without this. You feel me? Like I got brothers back home that like I mean, 
brothers I can call and like, honestly, these mics, two of these mics came from one of my brothers when I got fired. Mm. I tell the story all the time. He gave me $1,700. I got fired from radio. He said, bro. And even being a black sheep, they still did that for man, you. Man, what? So no, I'm the black sheep everything. of my chapter. Right. But my line, bro, what, man, these guys, man, I would never. I, mm. And that's why I go so hard, though, because it's like, man, it's, I've been in some predict. I remember little things. My own blood family wouldn't even put me on that car insurance. Mm. A nigga that I barely even know, my line brother, put me on his car insurance. You're like little things, little things. You feel me? Like, man, this is one of the best things. I joke about it because I can joke about it, but like, what? This is one of the best things that ever happened to mm. me in my life. In my life, Facts. like literally. Yeah. If I don't even meet no other man of Omega, it's the best thing. One of the best things that happened to me. You feel me? Like. Same. It come with some bullshit, but like right. it is what it is. Yeah. I mean, we got the ultimate networking experience in college. Yeah, fuck for that. College, even, even without the net, I'm just like the people I like. The I people came you connected with, with, but, bro. but yeah. that's that is nah, the experience. That right. is the experience. Nah. That is the core of what we were supposed to do. Mm. We right. did what we were supposed to do. You're right. You were supposed to meet people that were supposed to change your life. That's, that's a fact. why you joined. People right. join for that life-changing mm -hmm. experience. Yep. So we can say what our experience was and we can talk about the pros and the cons, but that in the, the end of the day, we join to meet and to elevate and to grow and to learn and create lifetime bonds in whatever way we could. Mm -hmm. And I think that we got that. You got that on I the money. That. That's, That's a true. fact. Yeah, I, I appreciate y'all for pulling up, man. Wait, side note, I will be hosting the uh, Alphas National Convention this year. I just want to say that. Oh, boy, my, we got a hundred. We got a we got a we got a centennial coming through. Hundred years in a in a, in a um chapter. A hundred years as a chapter in a fraternity. Mm. I wish they did call me the host, man. Dang it, nigga! What? I mean, it took, me, it took me ten years though. It oh, called Terrence J. Wow. Yeah. Shout out <laughs> to Terrence J. But I think yeah. you would do a better job. Though. I mean, I think I would. definitely whatever. <laughs> For y'all chapter. For they our chapter. Terms? I mean, it'd be like, my school ain't never hit me to come back to do shit. So. Hey, but I know, I, like, but if I say this, I'm hating. You know, like, yeah. And if they ask you though, they want the they want the school discount price. Why? You know, you want the school here, man. Go ahead and look out for Bro, the this. Is, we can't have this. Is, we can't have this conversation right, in public. Bad, Yo, this is great. This is it's a lot of. I ain't dropping none of the positive stuff. We talking about the last part. About my brothers and shit. I ain't dropping none of that shit. Well, we're just keeping keeping the part my ending. Oh, no, right? I ain't dropping none of that. Like, I just go with the whole, everything gonna be on there, but the shit I'm posting on Instagram, oh, oh yeah, I ain't dropping none of that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, this thing is crazy. <laughs> I'm posting all the crazy shit. That should be working, though. It, it works. It Content do. is king. Content is king. They like, this nigga's cat. <laughs> they gonna ban me for the frat. They fuck around. <laughs> like, you talking shit about oh, that's right now. I'm Christian. Like, oh hell no, this nigga Jay crazy. He was throwing the yo. Oh, oh hell no. Y'all appreciate y'all for pulling up, man. This is fun. Like, I, 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 I this is something I enjoy. Like, mm. need more things like this, bro. I'm trying to get y'all pull up again. She like, nah, it's one time, one and done. He said, I heard what you said. J Hill podcast, man. I appreciate y'all. Greek shenanigans. Uh, that's the name of this episode. Mm. Mm. Greek shenanigans. Okay. Greek shenanigans. Uh, let everybody know how to follow y'all, how to connect with y'all and everything. Well, y'all can follow me at Talent T. It's talent with an extra E at the end before the D. So Talent T. Mm. That's on Instagram and TikTok, Twitter. Everything across the board, Mr. Underscore Bankshot. And I'm Jayla Corian on everything. If you type in Jayla K, I'll pop up. She's just that lit. That lit. J Hill Podcast, uh, Mr. J Hill Network. I appreciate y'all. It's a wrap. We out. Gang. We out. <laughs>